I would say to focus more on review because I was, uh, when I was during the first three months of intense study, I was just doing PTs after PTs and not reviewing it well enough. I just see, I just read the read question explanations and, and, and think, okay, I got it. But that's not how things work. Um, I was just doing the same thing and expect something would change. So if I have, if I am to give any advice to any LSAT, LSAT, LSAT studying students is to never um, just do PTs after PTs. And uh, it's much better to review them thoroughly, um, understand your habits, understand what is, understand what is tricking you, uh, understand how, how you can do better the next time. So I would say the first one um, I would say is to be patient. And the second one is to be, um, be mindful when you're taking, when, when you're um, taking the exam. So uh, I remember the one when I got 161 was the uh, infamous PT88. Um, I was tr quite, if you guys have watched the video I, I've done with um, Steve for the Q&A, I was quite thrown off by that uh, first really surprisingly hard out logic games. So I just basically couldn't focus for the rest of the exam. Uh, but when I was taking the um, exam last August, uh, the one I got 171 for, I also encountered quite a difficult logic games uh, section. But at the time I was able to be more mindful of, oh, okay, I'm in, I'm in anxious mode. Uh, I need to get back to gear. So that really helped me too. So I would say if there are two things that really changed during my initial prep and my uh, final exam, I would say is to be patient and to be mindful. Always try to review questions thoroughly with the Socratic review method to examine your habits and adjust them and see what tricks beyond these elements um, I looked for that you are getting tricked so, so that you can adjust your habits and be more accurate next time. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.